Uscreen is a cutting edge, fully accessible website for 14 to 24 year olds, where you can make, show and share films online with a Uscreen community and the rest of the world. Uscreen has amazing free online tools and resources to help you learn more about filmmaking. Plan your film using the 3D storyboarding tool. Create your own characters and upload your own backgrounds to help your vision come to life. Or use the stock library images. The cutting tool is a great way to learn about editing. Here you can chat, plan and edit your film online with other Uscreen members. Import your own film clips and music to create your film. See how other members would edit your film using the collaborative editing chat facility. Then share your film on the Uscreen website. Add subtitles, audio description, visual captions, commentary and British Sign Language to your film using the player's accessibility tool. This is a great way to allow everyone to enjoy your film. Uscreen will keep you informed on workshops, competitions and festivals both nationally and internationally. Uscreen helps to fund films, workshops and festivals and will be holding competitions throughout the year. Uscreen also offers mentoring advice, guidance and our in-depth downloadable how-to guides are a great resource to learn about the film industry. Uscreen funded Wills of Fortune written by and starring actor David Proud. Over the three-day shoot the students of the Valence School were able to get hands-on experience by being part of the production team. The collaboration with the students proved to be a great success as it was a great opportunity for young people to gain experience on a professional film. Now let's watch one of the films made possible by Uscreen. There's lots of countries that come together to complete the Olympics and every four years the, the Olympics will go to one, like, one country. I think the great way of opening the, the London Olympics will be a really good firework display. I think it'd be really great in the opening and closing ceremony to have the girls allowed to perform because they're all really good singers and I think they'd be really good to represent Britain in front of the whole world. I hope the X Factor judges aren't there to look at them. It would be great if the Red Arrows flew over to the Olympic Stadium. It takes a lot of dedication to be good at judo. The way they fight and how they how they play it, it's really good. Fencing is a really great sport to watch in the Olympics. It's very fast and you need a lot of concentration. I think I'd be really good at fencing because I'm good at concentrating. How friendship is a very good value to um, hog beating in, in the Olympics. How about basketball? Well, because um, um, it's uh, a very good sport for my health. To get a basket and it's good to be tall. To compete in shooting, you have to be brave because it can be quite dangerous if you're not careful. When you're watching shooting in the Olympics, you might learn how to do it properly because the athletes are really well trained. I think diving is a great sport at the Olympics. You need a lot of technique to compete in diving. I hope Simon Cowell isn't one of the judges. He doesn't know anything about diving. To compete in the Olympics at the velodrome, you need to have bags of confidence. 
because it's quite scary. To be good at sailing, you have to be really confident on the boat. You really need to be determined to play rugby, especially at the Olympic, because everyone there is top of their game. In Olympic sports like volleyball, it's important to have teamwork if you want to win a game. Swimming is a really competitive sport in the Olympics. You have to be ultra fit to, to compete in swimming. I'm really looking forward to watching the Olympics. If you would like to learn more about the Uscreen website or sign up to become part of the growing Uscreen community, go to www.uscreen.co.uk. Thanks for watching.